welcome back to Andrea Saves. I'm Andrea and today we are going to do our football savings challenge, our everyday spending binder and our luxury binder. So we have, this is 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200 for our challenges and then uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten in our L bucks that we found this week for luxury savings. All right. So first and foremost is the football challenge. This week was playoff games, and it was Seahawks versus 49ers, which is my team and my husband's team. And so unfortunately we are out my husband's team moved on so that is exciting for him um so we are going to finish up our seahawks savings challenge for the football so this week we owe this 23 dollars so here's 20 one two three and we should have a total of $430 based on my calculations earlier. So I have 400 already in the Ally Savings account. So that gives us 425, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. And this will be deposited. And once football season is completely over or both of our teams are out, then I will transfer both of these totals from the savings challenge bucket in my ally account to the emergency savings challenge so my husband's team won they stomped us <laughs> so it stinks but it is what it is so this week they got 41 points so 20 and 41 so, all right so we have already 40 400 and 50, 70, 91. So we have 491 saved up for them. Now that my team is out and there is no hope, I hope I am going to root for my husband's team quietly. <laughs> we won't tell him. And unless he watches this video, he won't know. <laughs> so that is for the football savings challenge. Now what is left for our everyday binder so this is the binder that i get to use to buy groceries and such i have 20 40 60 81 20 35 and 36. all right and we are going to just put in a couple of our things so i'm going to put 76 dollars in the food 20 40 60 75 76 so that will go to groceries and that covers my groceries cover all all things that i buy at the grocery store or costco and that is including like toilet paper and things like that as well so that is going to be our budget for this week is 76 dollars And then for our gas envelope, we are going to put 40 in. So last week on when my husband needed to get gas, he was trapped away from the house. We had some power lines that came down on both sides of our street. So to leave our house to get to any town around us, you have to go one of either right or left off of our road. And in order to do that, it was blocked. There was power lines down on both sides. If I think about it, I will put a picture up of one of the little areas. So he had to use his card to put gas in. So I am just going to add the $40 to the 20, the 40 that was there from last week. And maybe we can get a little bit ahead of that while we are trying um, to do that. So that is going to give us $80 and hope for a better week this week with the weather. Last but not least, I am going to put $20 into the pets. This is going to give us money for animal food. I do have um, dogs, cats, and chickens, and so it does cost 
quite a bit of money to keep them all fed, especially with the fact that the prices have increased. So that is all I'm going to put in our weekly spending. Now that my team is out of the running in this football challenge, we should have a few more dollars. And then once football is done, we will have a little bit more because I do budget $200 per week to deal with this. And so we've been using this the extra the money for the football challenge as well so once football season is over this will get two hundred dollars per week in this binder just by itself all right next is the vacation challenge and i have ten dollars all l dollars for luxury and vacation is my favorite luxury so we will be rolling the dice and we will see. So this one is our for this year. This is going to get number one and six. I have a Vegas envelope for number two. Disneyland for number three. 20th anniversary for number four. And Nashville for number five. So we will just put add one dollar per roll. Number one. And when we get done, we will add them up and see how much we have. Number two, one for Vegas, number five, that is the last one, number three, four, and three. I also have the, um, the Wordle Challenge is helping to put some money into some of these. If you watch my savings or my Friday large binder challenges, that will show you what I'm doing with Wordle. I'm having a competition with my mother at the moment. So whoever wins in the Wordle Challenge technically loses saving. So we are swapping the money so whoever wins will end up with the most and whoever loses will end up with the least and so once i get to fifty dollars in any of these i will probably save put them in to their envelopes or their pockets their buckets on my um And my ally account sorry <laughs> all right so let's see so this one i do not know what we're going to do probably stay close to home but this is for this year so i have 25 30 31 32 33 34 and 35 and this one i pro may not put in the bank at all because we will probably need to use that vegas this one is 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. So uh, none of these other trips are going to be this year, so I do have a little bit of time to build them up. So I am not putting tons of money away right now. I'm working at trying to build my savings account and also pay down some debt. So I have 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, and 31 for Disneyland. That is one of my favorites, but it has been a few years since we have been. Probably about six years now. So 20th anniversary, I have 20, 1, 2, and 3. And this one is happening in 2025. I don't know that we will take a trip, but this will be money to celebrate that anniversary because that is a big deal. All right. And Nashville. 25 26 27 28 and 29 and this is going to be a girls trip with my mother we were supposed to go in 2020 and well we all know what happened then all right thank you so much for being here i am thankful for your time and i will see you in the next video bye